गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रेन लेट्स स्टार्ट विथ लेसन सिक्स द माइंस एंड द एलिफेंट्स एक्सरसाइज एंड द क्वेश्चन आंसर सो फर्स्ट वी विल डू द एक्सरसाइज दैट इज ऑन पेज नंबर सेवेंटी फाइव मेकिंग कनेक्शंस क्विक आंसर्स इन ए स्टोरी द प्रॉब्लम इज वॉट वेंट रॉन्ग सो टिक द सेंटेंस दैट टेल्स अस अबाउट द प्रॉब्लम इन दिस स्टोरी Long ago near a lake in a thick forest there lived a large mouse family many of the elephants were caught in the great rope traps the mouse king called all the mice together so which one is the answer many of the elephants were caught in the great rope traps this went wrong in the story in a story the solution is how things were made right in the end टेक द सेंटेंस द टेल अस अबाउट द सोल्यूशन इन दिस स्टोरी नियर ए रिवर ऑन द अदर साइड ऑफ द फॉरेस्ट देर लिव ए हर्ड ऑफ एलिफेंट्स वन डे एलिफेंट ट्रैपर्स केम टू द फॉरेस्ट द ग्रुप्स ऑफ माइज ग्रॉट द रॉप्स ऑफ ट्रैप्स विद ए टाइनी शार्प टिथ सो द ग्रुप्स ऑफ माइज ग्रॉट द रॉप्स ऑफ ट्रैप्स विद ए टाइनी शार्प टिथ इज द राइट आंसर दिस वॉज द सोल्यूशन ऑफ द स्टोरी Now let's see what is there in page number seventy-six. That is opposite. We have to write the opposites of these words: enormous, up, caught, remembered, and best. So enormous, tiny, up, down, caught, free, remembered, forgot, best, worst. Now making new connections. Use the picture clues to make words out of the letters of the word elephant. So here word is there, and we have to pick by seeing the picture. We have to pick out the words and write here. So first one is petal, P E T A L. This is plate, P L A T E. P hen, P E A H E N. P L A N E, plane. plant p l a n t peel p e e l heel h e e l tape t a p e now coming to the grammar time we use of has and have we will learn where to use has and where to use have this has and have is used to show what position position means things belonging to so where to use has has is used for one person or animal means with singular noun we will use has that is he she it like he has she has it has now have have is used for more than one person animal or thing that is with the plural i you we they we use have that is i can be anyone you myself or any other and you can be anyone one person more than one person so with i you also we use have so here are some pictures where to use ani has a dog tom and any have a dog i have a dog you have a dog so use this table to practice saying sentence with have and has so here are some pictures given you can practice it i you Tom and any grandma and grandpa, my friends, we Tom, any he, she, dog. With this all, we will use has. With Tom and any grandma and grandpa, my friends, we we will use have, and I and you, we will use have. Now, let's see. Do the fill in the blanks with has and have. So, grandfather and grandmother have a farm. They are working on the farm. Grandfather has a spade. Grandmother has a watering can. Grandfather and grandmother have lots of animals. The horse has a brown tail. The rooster has a green tail. The ducks have orange beaks. Grandfather and grandmother have two tractors. Grandfather has a red tractor. Grandmother has a blue tractor. I love go going to the farm. I have lots of fun there. Do you have a farm? so all these you come to know about has and have now here you see we have to match the action word to the naming word action word means verb and naming word means noun where to use the 
verb properly with the naming word the girl dances the girls dance here you can see the girl is singular so with the singular we will use s to the verb that is dance is a verb and we will use s and with the girls two girls are there since girls is plural with the plural form with the verb we will not use s the frog jumps the frogs jump the boy sings the boys sing the kitten sleeps the kittens sleep so all these the people the girl the frog this all about whom we speak is called the subject and the action of the verb that have to match or agree with the subject is called the subject verb agreement like the girl dances so this is the girl is the subject and dances is the verb so with the singular we have used the proper with the verb s so it is called the subject verb agreement so now we will tick against the sentence that are correct and put a cross against those that are incorrect that is the subject verb agreement a the baker bake a cake so it is cross the baker bakes a cake it is tick john runs fast it is tick john run fast it is cross the ducks swim in the pond tick the ducks swims in the pond so cross so here we have learned the baker is single and bake is verb we do have not used s so it is cross and the baker is single and with the verb we have used s so it is swing the subject verb agreement so we have put a tick now let's see, let's see d the girls plays volleyball tick the girl play volleyball cross the cat sleep on the mat tick the cat sleeps on the mat so it is cross so let's do the in text question and answer so why did the herd of elephants move across the forest the herd of elephants moved across the forest in search of water which word is used to describe the way mice move the word scurry is used to describe the way mice move why did the mice want to help the elephants the mice wanted to help the elephants because the elephants had been kind to them we're coming to reference to contest which season was it it was summer season why did the herd need to search water search for water since the river had run dry the herd needed to search for water where was water found water was found in a lake on the other side of the forest the question number 4 who remembered the promise the elephant queen remembered the promise what was the promise the promise was that that the mice would help the elephants who was the little friend the mouse king was the little friend now read and reflect five question number 5 how did the elephants disturb the mice at first when the elephants entered the mouse colony the their huge feet destroyed their houses as well as their stores of food so thank you children